One of the world's most active volcanoes is erupting once again. Scientists say a new vent has opened at the Kilauea volcano in Hawaii, sending lava shooting as high as 65 feet into the air. It happened when part of the crater floor collapsed. And our meteorologist, Jackie Jarris, is here with more on what's happening. This thing has been erupting for a long time, but this is yeah. new. Right. This is, yeah, this is a new fissure, basically, or a new eruption, a ring of fire uh, that has developed in the area. And geologists are actually saying a pretty similar thing happened uh, back in 1997. So these are intermittent eruptions that are taking place that are just spectacular to look at on video, but it's part of the ongoing eruption that's been happening on Kilauea since about 1983, so nearly 30 years that we've been dealing with this uh, as well. Now, what happened? Let me show you a Google Earth, and it'll kind of give you a better idea of the area that we're talking about and what happened here. So we'll zoom in and show you. There you can see the big island. And as you take a look at all these little dots here, those yellow and orange dots, those are earthquakes, basically movement that's been taking place uh, under the ground with this lava and this eruption and that collapse of the crater floor. Now, we'll zoom in and we'll take you to what's called the Pu'o'o crater. And the floor in this area here, which has been active, there you can see some a gas there that has collapsed and as a result of the collapse further off to the north and west is where we have uh, another crater the Nepal crater and this is where that eruption uh, has been taking place so uh, significant development certainly not unheard of a spectacular video and something we'll continue to watch and if you want to watch this at home by the way if you just go to Google and you Google the Hawaiian Volcano Observatory you'll find these web pages and take a look at some of the images that they've just taken in the last uh, 20 24 hours. They also have webcams here, and this is a live webcam that you're looking at at uh, the Nepal crater, and they just were able to put this up today to get that there. If you look right in the middle, you can see a little bit of the flame, but it's a very cloudy, foggy, wet day in Hawaii, so it's hard to be able to see anything. I, we want to take a look, another look, Jackie, at these new pictures that are just in the CNN. Look at wow. that, uh, 65 feet into the air. Uh, we're told about 150 small earthquakes were recorded within Kilauea right. in the past 24 hours. No homes. There's small the earthquakes, yeah. so, you know, most people probably wouldn't feel very much from something like that. No homes are in the way. This is kind of a remote area. Um, they did shut down uh, the chain of craters road in the area and some of the trail to keep people away. Volcanoes, um, typically, in all this lava, you know, they emit gases. And so yeah. there's a gas, sulfur dioxide, and it's lethal if the concentrations are high enough. So you need to stay about a kilometer or maybe half a mile or so away from that. Otherwise, you're going to have a problem.